Good morning from Cape Coral. We didn't get to really show you around last night because we got in so late. So um, yeah, we're gonna show you around. We're gonna go to a farmer's market this morning and go grocery shopping and then just kind of explore. Hi folks. Hi. <laughs> Oh, we are Phil and Sue. For the last year, we have taken our newfound hobby of photography and started to explore our local rural communities, our home state of Wisconsin, the neighboring states, and eventually the rest of the USA. As we explore, we find that... Always an adventure. We drive through the streets of Cape Coral. Let's have a little history lesson. Cape Coral is a city located in Lee County, Florida, on the Gulf of Mexico and alongside the Caloosahatchee River. The city's population has grown to 200,972 as of 2020. Cape Coral is the largest city between Tampa and Miami in both population and area. Cape Coral was founded by two brothers, Leonard and Jack Rosen from Baltimore, Maryland in 1957, so this city is still pretty new. They flew over the peninsula known as Redfish Point across the Caloosahatchee River near present-day Fort Myers. Leonard and Jack, who were real estate developers, along with a small group of partners, purchased a 103 square mile tract known as the Redfish Point for $678,000 in that year and in 1958 began developing the city as a master planned, pre-planned community. What makes Cape Coral unique is that the city has over 400 miles of waterways, more than any other city on earth. Most of the canals can be navigated and some have access to the Gulf of Mexico. Cape Coral's canal system is so extensive that local ecology and tides have been affected. These canals were developed in the 1970s to divert freshwater runoff to the mangrove forest that bordered Cape Coral instead of going into the Caloosahatchee River, Matlacha Pass, and the Gulf of Mexico. So it was really fun to learn about this history of Cape Coral, Florida. Welcome to the Cape Coral Farmer's Market. Here's a little about the farmer's market that we attended. Cape Coral Farmer's Market is open every Saturday from 8 a.m. to 1 p.m. It is located in downtown Cape Coral in Club Square. The Cape Coral Farmer's Market has been a favorite Saturday morning destination for over 26 years. Over the years, they have grown to over 125 vendors. They have delicious food, and local crafts that people love to shop for. Fresh, local, and healthy fruits and vegetables, including certified organic produce, are the core of the market along with homemade and handmade foods and crafts. Fresh baked breads and pastries, homemade pickles, jams and jellies, gulf fresh seafood, fresh meats, homemade pet treats, handcrafted soaps, essential oils, local honey, made on site guacamole, fresh cut flowers, native plants and trees are just some of the fantastic products available here. This was a wonderful experience for us and we ended up purchasing fresh fruits, vegetables and baked bread for our vacation week. checked out almost all the fresh produce vendors we could possibly find. Everything looked so fresh, delicious, bright, and wonderful. It was so hard to choose. So we went to multiple uh, vendors to find our different produce, um, and we found some bread. It was, it was such a fantastic experience.
thank you guys. I got white asparagus. One of those left. See that? We'll take a white one and a green one. All right. You guys can add anything else. Get you to ten. Blueberry, cherry, raspberry, blackberry, strawberry. <laughs> Strawberry? Yeah. All right. There we go. Now you're at 10. Okay. Anything else? There you go, mushrooms. I do. I've got um, baby portobello and oyster mushrooms today. All right. Now you guys will be 13. Anything else? How much are the potatoes? Potatoes, you can have some of them for two more bucks. You want to do that? Sure. <laughs> And I can see the 15. How about that? That's perfect. Good morning. And this strapping young lad right here. And this strapping young lad right here. He's like, I got too much. He has a lot of All right. You got some yeah. yeah. oranges? <laughs> like three days. All right. Well, then why don't we put you guys at uh, 18? Give me another bar. I might have to find another 20 here. What kind of excuse me? Those are Donnie out there. Yeah. Uh, you can get some baby bok choy, get some cucumbers and carrots, you can get a couple onions. Right, Yeah, grab four carrots. Have a good one. Oh yeah, good for juicing, they're sweet, they got a nice soft pour. I suppose I better carry that one, everybody else is carrying that Well, thank you guys very much, have a great week. That was fun. Just a quick reminder to subscribe to the channel, like, and hit that notification bell. Thanks for watching!